Hi everybody, uh, welcome to my latest video. I thought I'd just do something a bit about uh, brushing of a square today. So we're in, we're in February now. Um, normally this time of year, probably be frozen solid, not much growth. Um, obviously we got a bit, you know, it's quite warm for this time of year though. Very easy not to get too carried away also though. Um, I just thought I'd do a bit on brushing a cricket square as I say. Um, the aim really is just to collect up litter that forms over the season. Um, I've just brushed this, I just want to show you, look. there's lots of scarring in here from disease, Lot, some dead leaves there to collect, I'll go into that a bit more in a minute, um, just show you what we've removed, so you can see most of this material is pretty brown, lots of dead leaves there, moved about a full box off our two squares, um, as I say the, the idea is uh, dead leaves, uh, the plant even in winter is shedding leaves, it's sort of four or five leaf plant, it's shedding leaves, leaves are falling off, dying with disease, um, you've got the drop-ins when you cut, not everything goes in the box, you've got leaves, um, rabbit drop-ins, it's all organic material really, we ideally need to collect up, which can lead to uh, thatch problems and uh, sort of that litter round on the surface also is sort of breeding ground for some diseases as well, which isn't ideal. Um, and we're also coming into pre-season rolling in probably a month's time. So it's good to just collect up um, as much of this material as possible that's laying in, laying in the top of the canopy. Um, ideally, you'd be doing this monthly or so just to keep on top of it. But obviously this winter, it's been so wet, we've not been able to do that. So my plan really, um, is to probably do this once a week, gentle, um, you know, it's still quite cold out, out here, um, so you, you could possibly verti cut, which is another option. Um, whatever you, I, I think brushing's a bit more effective if you've got the uh, cassette cartridge, I'd use the cassette, but it's really down to you what you've got, what you feel works for you. Whatever you use, I think uh, it's important to match the aggression of the machine on the surface with um, how much you, you how much it's growing basically so if it's growing loads you can hammer it a bit it will fill back in um, if it's not really growing then don't hammer it too much um, it's not really going to like it with the brush in it's a bit more gentler and as I said I'll sort of be doing this over the next couple of weeks um, if I put a granular fertilizer on then I'll stop um, but yeah, that's it really. Um, just looking through my notes, just see if there's anything else. Really, I think that's about it. Just, I say the main aim is to clean up the surface of all them dead leaves and litter and debris over the season um, and match that um, aggression with growth. Um, but yeah, I hope that was helpful. Um, any comments, anything you, you know, anything you want to ask, just put in the, in the comments. Can't guarantee to know everything. It's more about just knowledge sharing this. Um, but thanks for watching and cons please consider subscribing.